Hey, welcome back to another short episode of Excelsior. So, uh, I have like quarter of an hour right now, so I'm just gonna, just gonna play this for a bit and, um, maybe make a little more progress here. So, Castle Griswold, Borinthia and Burrows. So let's go over here. Maybe go to the castle, maybe go to Burrows, I guess. Or Borinthia. There was something in Borinth... Oh dear. Sorry, need to get up my notes. Uh, Borinthia, Borinthia, Borinthia. Oh, there was the healing stuff, okay. Well, that's kind of all there is. So let's get this and uh, let's go through here. Autosave, yes, like always. <laughs> There's a little bit of a mountain path here. And now we are somewhere behind the mountains. Okay. Hey, there's a little bit of a peninsula here, but there's nothing really on it. And, uh, yeah, let's continue murdering things, I guess. And that seems to be the castle down there. Yes, it is. It is the castle, and there's also a town. So, what do we have here? A short sword. Um, well, we can drop that at some point. Let's enter this town. Oh, this is actually Owenfield. There was some stuff in Owenfield, wasn't there? Yeah. The resting place of the father of the dude, and a gypsy that might be of use. Okay. I still don't approve of the term, but um, let's talk to this guy. It's a guard. For years I have served at the right side of Lord Valkyrie, yet for some reason he has undergone a dramatic shift in personality. I do not know why it occurred, but I do know that this change is not for the best, says the Valiant, Valiant Paladin. Valiant, not Valiant, sorry. Okay, indeed, something has been going on with this with uh, with the king. Let's inspect this is the herbalist, which is probably a healer. Oops, no. Talk. Yeah, it's a healer. And you are... Hmm. It is a gypsy, but she doesn't really tell us anything. Maybe you? Yeah, the gypsy, a year. Aya, I don't know, appears somewhat distracted. I sense apprehension in your mind, indeed I do. But is truly a common co procedure for some. But tis truly a common procedure for some surgeons. That is, I think I could fix you up nicely. Yes, quite nicely. For a lot of gold. Uh, no. Trust me, eh? I don't always trust myself either. But fair is fair. Can I talk to her again? It's that. Shall we just? You know what? I'm just gonna do it. Um, we're gonna get enough money to get better weapons and stuff later on anyways. I also forgot about that. So, um, yeah, let's just... Well, let's just say let's just say yes. The gypsy leads you into a makeshift medical room where you are put onto into a trance and then are given an unusual and somewhat painful operation. You awaken and sense a not feeling in your eyes. The gypsy interrupts your ponderance. Your eyes, they feel strange, no? It's because they are not your eyes at all. I've made a switch, isn't that clever? Uh, kind of horrifying, actually. Wouldn't you care to see them? You look and see two eyeballs floating in a basin filled with water, a sight you quickly turn away from. Helps her serve to her fee. And we got hurt quite a bit. 103 of 208. What's going on now? Um, let's see. Nothing has changed here, although we got hurt. Oh, that's the Dark Eyes skill. I don't know what that actually does, but um, maybe that makes us able to see in dungeons? Could be, right? Maybe. Hmm, good. So the only four skills that we have left is swimming, seamanship, music, and lockpicking. But, uh... Yeah, 
now our health is kind of down. Can we do disease curing? Oh yeah, that was we had a disease then. Oh well, okay. So that's what a disease does. It just limits your health. And let's just heal. For some reason our magic points didn't go down while healing. But um well, okay. The astrologer looks at you and says, Welcome. The stars shine bright upon you, although dark times lie ahead. She checks her astrological charts and mumbles, Ah, the charts tell me that you are here on a mission of some importance. Well, I can offer some advice. The forces you face are vast and powerful. It will take four items of fantastic power to for you to fulfill your destiny. Okay, miscellaneous... Main quest, I guess? Four items. And I see here that one man will show you the way when you are ready for it. When that time will be, I cannot see. Perhaps it has already passed, but the stars confirm that it will happen. Okay, four item. One man will show the way. Interesting. Okay. Make a note of that, and uh, let's continue. There's a green dude over here. Leave me be! So he is a, a hermit in a town. And uh, yeah, that's the... That is the card game. Which I don't want to play right now. Arms and armor. So what do you have? Buy. Aramel plate mail. That thing is probably really good. 1120. Okay, so well, we lost a bunch of money to get the dark eyes skill. But uh, yeah, we're probably gonna get this. This is probably better than the quick mail. The one thing is that we uh, need a bunch of money for that. But maybe we can sell stuff to him. Yes, we can. The winged boots. Yeah, let's sell those. And the shield. Weaponsmith greets us. And we can sell weapons and armor here, so we can just walk around and uh, murder a bunch of dudes up here. So this is nothing interesting for us. While hunting in the rumbling range, I encountered a bizarre baobab tree. It's hidden well among the mountains, but from what I understand, it's quite valuable because of its uniqueness. Okay. There's a lot of miscellaneous stuff here. Rumbling range, baobab tree among the mountains. Huh. Don't know what that's all about. Yeah, you have only gen generic stuff to say, you too. There's a graveyard. Expect you find nothing. You see a grave. Okay. All right, can't really do anything here. Did we already talk to these people? Chicken and turkey. Okay. Yeah. Um, how about we get some money now? We just murder fools. Let's dismount the horse so that enemies will come faster. Yes. Well, let's get the lantern. Yes, hand axe, large shield. Yeah, we're just gonna kill things and sell the stuff. Maybe we can even sell the short bow. That would be nice. Morning star. Hey, can you please just spawn? Yes, like this. Gold pieces, let's pick up. Oh, our backpack is already full. So let's murder those. We could also just level up now, I guess. We are pretty well equipped and stuff, so... Oops, that dude just shot at us. Let's enter and sell, of our, sell all of our nonsense and... Um, yeah, we're just gonna rinse and repeat that so that we don't need to return here later, I guess. 
So, talk to you, sell, large shield. Talk to you, sell, hand axe, spear, short bow. Okay, we can actually indeed get rid of our short bow here. All right. Yes, exit. No, no, let's not talk to this guy. And uh, yeah, save, auto save. Get buckler and gold. I'm just gonna get everything. Let's just get rid of that scout because you are going on my nerves. Let's heal up. Yeah, healing is no problem anymore. That's good. And a chain mail, we can sell that for a lot. That is good. Speed him and greaves. The short sword. Let's get the helm. Take these guys. Bunch of money. We also take money directly, why not? And a dagger, but our backpack is full. So, enter town. Yeah, I know this is fantastic television, but playing old role-playing games, and this is just what what will happen, I guess. Sell, buckler, chainmail, helm. Okay, we might actually already have enough. Talk, buy, plate mail. Yes, we can. Excellent. Anything else? No. Where the plate mail? Yes, and it is indeed better. Sell. The quick plate. Oh, we get a bunch of money for that. Except. Good. And, uh, yeah, that's good. That's enough. Oh, yeah, now we got a minus to dexterity. But I think this, this will be all right. We will at some point uh, use the amulet and then get all that stuff. Okay, um, let's get this dagger. We have a bunch of money, we could actually deposit some of that in the bank. Broadsword. Yeah, let's enter the castle now. How about that? Enter the castle. Inspect to the door, to the left. Okay, uh, interesting. Oh yeah, and there's the next orb. Good, 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 good. Castle entrance. This is needlessly complicated. <laughs> okay, let's talk to you. Enjoy your stay and obey the law. Yeah, this is always the same everywhere. This is probably the bank. Let's lockpick the bank, which is probably a good idea. Yeah, let's deposit a thousand gold here. So that we can maybe earn some interest on that. How much do we have in the in the bank now? Yeah, got 60, 63 for what we had, and there's the orb for the green amulet. Good. And uh, let's open this. Pick that lock. Unlocked. Unlocked. Let's talk to you. Who are you? You are nobody. You only have generic things to say. Unlocked. Open. Yeah, of course it's locked. Unlocked. Talk to you. Yes, you're just a man with a handshake. Alright. Okay, good. Um, who are you? You're just a guard. Can you get in there? No. Nobody has any problems with us. Picking locks all the time. My name is Pefli. Praise King Valkyrie. Pefli. I forgot what. Um, let's see. I'm probably gonna make a note of this guy. Castle. Grim something. I forgot that. Pefli. Talk to this guy. Enjoy your stay. So, Rodagarn, Rodagarn, local ruler of Lusandia South. So, Sir Rodagarn. Just make note of notable people that we that we encounter. This is probably... Yes, this is probably the food stuff. Um, let's just get some gruel. Do 
we have over here? Nothing, I think. Yeah, nothing. So there isn't much here except these two people and the green orb. Hmm. We can't get through here because of these stupid guards. Okay, um, yeah, this is the castle then, I guess. I think we have talked to everybody. Yeah, we did. Anything up here? No. No. We can't get down there because there's this stupid guard. Okay, let's leave. So that's the castle. We are done here. Let's just explore this peninsula, or this, uh, not peninsula, but this area a little. Uh, let's get the lantern. Also, what I also want to do is I want to take a look at... at, uh, at the dungeon again. When we get back there, I will just do that. Okay, so there isn't much more to this, I guess. Right? Right. Yeah, this is basically this area. Um, to the dungeon again and see if that's actually what the Dark Eyes do. If it is, then we don't actually need to get any more, any more lanterns and all this kind of junk. So that's good. Yeah, this is actually it for this area. All right, this, let's get this, and uh, boop, get up here, get up here, talk to this guy, sell the helm, talk to this guy, sell the dagger, the broadsword, and the staff. We have three lanterns, that's way too much. Also, we don't need that torch. Also, still don't know what that rock does. You know what, I'm gonna save my game. 6 LP 7 and let's just use that rock okay you can't do anything with the rock at the moment well that's good to know that is good to know now we are done here we could use some better weapons couldn't we uh, let's just leave that stuff here we don't need that let's go back let's go back behind that mountain range again Bunch of food, which is also good to get. Let's kill that scout. We can probably level up like nothing else. And yeah, gonna do that soon because um, these enemies are getting a little tedious. Maybe I'm gonna level up after I got the next uh, next better weapon. That would be. Either we could get the Ginzo sword, or we could see if we find something better. There are weapons that are better than that. But, uh, okay, Borinthia is down. So this was... Hollow? Yes, it was hollow. So let's go to Borinthia. There was something in Borinthia that was interesting. So, um, oh yeah, that was just the healing stuff. Maybe not. But let's explore Borinthia, so maybe we can get some more hints, and maybe there's some more interesting stuff there. Right? Right. Right. Shooting at me from across the screen. What's that all about? Scout, what do you say for yourself? Let's get the dagger. Let's kill this guy. Oh, a lot of food. Yeah, I will take that. Certainly I will. loot. Let's drop the loot. It's annoying to get rid of. Number nine. All right. And there is... is that Borinthia? Yes, it is Borinthia. Hello, guy. Nice to meet you, says the man with a handshake. Inspect greetings from the Borinthian citizenry. Oh, yeah, sure. Enjoy your stay and obey the law. You. I'm Janelle, says the gypsy. You, like many unfortunates, appear landlocked. The place to remedy that is not on this land on the land at all. She giggles out loud at this riddle. That's probably either swimming or seafaring. Question mark. Not on the land? Question mark. Let's make a note of that. 
You seem to know a great deal about medicine and aid. Perhaps you would care to volunteer and help tend the wounded here? Yeah, this is probably where we could get the... Where we could get the... The bandage skill, but we already have that skill, so... Leave me be! Yes, you are a guard, I know. Um, innkeeper. So we could go to the inn. What are you? Mystic beauty. Yeah, sure. There's a woman with blue fires over here. The herbalist. Okay, no. Don't need to do anything with the herbalist. There's a grill, so we can probably shop some food here. Yes, we can. That's a generic dude. Have you ever heard of one named Varbel? He was one of the most gifted men of our time. All but disappeared. I fear for his life. Okay, miscellaneous. Dude named Varbel has disappeared. Okay, 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 okay. And uh, what else do we have here? Oh, he also wants to play games with us. Maybe we're gonna get into this later on. I don't have a mind for that right now. I'm Nelva. I used to work for King Valkyrie until I quit over differences in views. And he was replaced by some weasel named Pefli. Okay. So we've already talked to Pefli. He was in the castle, yeah. The weaponsmith. Uh, can we sell some stuff here? Yes, we can. What do you have? Aromal dagger, short sword, charmed mace. No, nothing really interesting. So he's just an assassin. And you sell boots. Do we have any boots that we can sell? No. Okay, we might be done here. Yes, we might actually be done here, and I'm already going for 22 minutes, and I need to be I need to be gone right now, actually. So, uh, yeah, thank you for watching, and see you again in the next video. Thank you very much.